Hi, I'm Dr. George Ho of Vancouver. This movie has two major themes. The first one is to briefly introduce the article uh, I have it published in Tai Chi magazine in the winter 2015 issue. After analyzing Master Jiang Manqing's new method of Tai Chi Chuan Sao Cultivation published in English in 1999, after analyzing the English translation and Master Chang's original Chinese translation, I have come to the conclusion that one does not have to practice the neutralizing the incoming force called Fa Jing in order to exert one's Tai Chi power, which is called Fa Jing. And one does not have to practice pushing hand in order to become Dong Jing which is the initial foundation of furthering one's Tai Chi Kung Fu on one's own, which is called self-cultivation in the English version. In Chinese, it's, it's called Dong Jing. After you become Dong Jing, you become better and practice with your self-practice all on your own. This is the experiences and conclusions of most Tai Chi classics. However, most Tai Chi teachers will also quote Tai Chi classic, claiming that Tai Chi has to be taught in a face-to-face -face manner called Ko So in Chinese. Ko So means oral instructions. However, this Ko So experiences and requirement were written in Tai Chi classic before the camera and movie camera were invented. The camera can replace oral instruction, but the requirement of cell cultivation for further refinement remain. In the article, I have also advocate the use of Bantian singing to monitor and to train uh, one's Tai Chi Kung Fu when you're doing cell cultivation. From personal experiences, I can tell you it's the same Bantian used in Chinese opera singing and acting and in Tai Chi. After reading my article, the president of the Tai Chi Federation in Europe gave me a real good review and he agrees that uh, singing, especially Dantian singing, is a very good way to learn Tai Chi Kung Fu. Another exciting and very positive feedback is from a music professor, Professor Ralph Lorraine of Kent State University. Professor Lorraine was so impressed with my idea of Dantian singing, he actually drafted up a proposal called Dantian Singing in Cantonese, a theory about the health impact of sound, and then he invited me to co apply with him to have this theory reviewed at the 6th International Conference on Health, Wellness and Society in October this year in Washington, D.C. And our application has been accepted. As a Cantonese Chinese, I'm very, very excited because I know the benefit of Tai Chi is well known to the West whereas the benefit of Dantian singing is just the beginning. Uh, Professor Lorraine told me the upcoming October discussion is probably just the first one and there will be many more subsequent discussion because it's a very interesting topic. Like this song I compose using the ending mantra of the Heart Sutra. <laughs> I composed this song using the melody from a Cantonese song sung by Miss Fong Yin Fun, written by Mr. Wong. Both of them are very famous singer and musician. I composed the lyric using the ending mantra of the Heart Sutra and part of the Heart Sutra. For more similar singing demonstration, like singing the mantra Om Mele Be Me Hom, 
please go to my channel and go to the singing demonstration playlist. You can listen to many other songs. Hi, I'm Dr. George Ho. This concludes the movie. And if you like this movie, please click like and please share it with your friend in other media like that Facebook. And it would really motivate me to make more movie like this if you would subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Dr. George. Subscription is totally free.